Hello again, everybody. Lane Trussell and Dave Brown right along ringside, ready to go. Another one, big one, championship wrestling. We've got a couple of special announcements. We'll get to that in a moment. David, how about our card today? Opening match today, single match. The big angel from Portland, Oregon, going to be in here in a single match against Carl Fergie. Then comes a special match. This one will be two out of three falls. There will be a 45-minute time limit on it, but a no-disqualification match. And in this one, Ken Lucas and Rick Morton will be going against Jimmy Valiant and Tojo Yamamoto. Not only that, we do have a standby match, depending on uh, the time situation. Tommy Rich, Coco Ware standing by to take on uh, Roger Kirby and Guy Mitchell. That's uh, one of those that if there is time, because, again, there is a 45-minute time limit uh, on the uh, Valiant, Tojo, Lucas, and Rick Morton Yeah, match. I hope we have time for that, too. That'll be a dynamite match indeed to see the uh, Southern Tag Team champs uh, put their belt, not put their belts up in a non-title match uh, against Tommy and Coco. We'll just have to wait and see about that. Plus the fact, Dave, that today we've got something else that I think is going to be most interesting. I have had, I guess, a jillion questions pertaining to Jerry the King Lawler. When's he going to get back and so forth? Okay, the time is near. Jerry will be here with us today. He will make the announcement about when his first match is going to be. And by the way, it is a most unusual match. I am sure that uh, you can well imagine that he's got Jimmy Hart right up on top of his priority yeah. list in there. Yeah. But the match is going to be a, against an opponent of Hart's selection. Oh. And then if Jerry uh, takes care of that opponent, then he's going to get five minutes with Jimmy Hart in the ring, and that's what he wants. Uh, we'll have more yeah. about that and all of it. We better get started. You stay right where you are. Call a friend. Championship wrestling a buzzing today, and we'll be back with the first of our return grudge matches on TV ever with Ken Lucas, Rick Morton, going against Handsome Jimmy and Tojo in just a moment. <laughs> already in the ring really uh, an outstanding wrestler we love to see Carl wrestle because he is such a professional uh, Jerry Calhoun in the ring here comes uh, Jimmy Hart chief cheerleader with a big angel out of Portland Oregon and Jimmy coming around for what purpose Jimmy let me tell you something Lance Russell I have never been more serious in my life than I'm standing out here telling you today Everybody knows that Jerry Lawler wants Jimmy Hart. Yes, sir. Everybody. So do you. Well, let me just tell you something, okay? I have gone out, and I've signed the meanest man in professional wrestling, the Angel, and the new Southern Heavyweight title. See, I'm so, right, right now, I, I, I'm just, I, I don't know, I'm just telling you right now, one thing. I've just signed Kirby and Mitchell, and I've signed the Angel. Jerry Lawler, I know you want me. You have got the chance of your lifetime right now, Lawler, and that's to walk through those doors and shake my hand and patch this thing up. Because I promise you, if it takes every penny that I can scrape up, if it takes everything I do, Lawler, I swear on a Bible, I swear on my mother's life right now. If you want to patch this thing up, let's do it, baby, because if you don't, you will never wrestle again. And I promise you that. You will never get in that ring again because I promise you I will put you out of professional wrestling forever. You understand? Right, now, that's, he's got a chance to come out here right now if he wants to and shake my hand, baby, and it's over. But if not, his career will be over. Yeah, I hear you, Jimmy. Well, you can figure you got about two chances, like the old saying is, slim and none of his come out of here and shaking your hand. Jimmy Hart uh, offering Lawler the opportunity to make up with him and all of that. Okay, Dave, let's get ready for this opening bout. One full 15-minute time limit match introducing from Portland, Oregon, 250 pounds on the left, the Angel. And on the right of the screen, from Atlanta, Georgia, 228 pounds, Carl Fergie. One full 15-minute time limit match, the referee, Jerry Calhoun. Jimmy Hart out of the ring, but still strolling. Uh-oh. The uh, opening of the bout, Dave, and the Angel started out nailing him with that big glove he's got on. Fergie whipped across the ring. The Angel with a boot. Going with a claw. He's got that big glove on the uh, controversial glove, too, on the right, uh, right hand. Fergie with a right hand. Trying to battle his way out of it. The Angel hanging on. Fergie finally broke it. 
Angel right back on it. <laughs> Grabs him again, top of the head. Art Piper over at ringside doing the cheerleading and all as he's screaming to the Angel, keep it up, keep it up. He's giving up, he's giving up. Carl Fergie, long way from that, Dave. He's battling back, trying to. He's not giving up at all. His right hand again. Angel's got him back on the ropes. Referee Jerry Calhoun's going to require a break back there. Oh, Angel shoves the referee down. Calhoun again, trying to get the Angel to break on the ropes. And again, Jerry Calhoun is pushed down. That's going to be it. Yes, sir. He calls for the bell to be won. Disqualification on the Angel, and uh, certainly a good decision by the referee. The Angel not breaking the hole, though. He's still got Carl Fergie pinned over on the uh, on the apron. He's got that big right hand on top of uh, uh, Fergie's forehead. Calhoun's still trying to get him broken up. He's selling Hart now. They can break it. Here comes Rick Morton, Ken Lucas. The Angel gets out of the ring as they appear. The official verdict went the other way, though, Dave. Carl Fergie gets the win. That's right. Time on it, a minute 23, 123, disqualification on the Angel. Big powerful Angel started right out by nailing Carl right in the back of the neck with that uh, gloved right hand that he says is for support where he injured in an accident. Mm -hmm. And um, Rick Morton and Ken Lucas uh, helping him out. Carl does get his hand raised on the disqualification. So in the opening bow, we didn't have very long of it. There's lots of action in there, but we've got plenty more to come. We've got that big return match that'll be coming up here. Our TV return match with Ken Lucas and Rick Morton going against Valiant and Yamamoto. All of that action right after we take time out. We'll be back to talk with the King about his future plans. Back to Wave Country's Championship Wrestling coming up in just a moment. I do want to remind you, Tuesday night, man, a complete card, which we'll give you a little later. Two big main event matches. Handsome Jimmy Valiant, Tojo Yamamoto face Tommy Wildfire Rich and Coco Ware in a return match. And then it's going to be Big Guy Mitchell and Roger Kirby, the AWA Southern Tag Champions, facing Bill Dundee and Rick Morton in the Louisville Gardens. Before we get into anything, I want to mention that this hole that you and Roger Kirby have used already put three or four people out. It looks like it's a whale of a lot more Listen, dangerous Mr. than TV the pile Mr. TV announcer, what I would like to say to you, I really don't care what you think. I don't care what most promoters think. All I'm doing is stepping into the ring with my partner here, and we are showing these people what wrestling is all about. Remember, if you cannot take it, get out. That's simple. You understand? What is your name? I understand. I'm really not, I'm not interested. Yeah. Okay. But what I would like to say, we are going to cripple many wrestlers. We are going to hurt many wrestlers. The idea, it says professional wrestling on the marquee That's outside. right, professional wrestling. Mr. Kirby and I do not rely on punching, kicking, eye gouging, or whatever. We are wrestlers, we are tough, and we are going to prove to the people in this area what wrestling is all about. And then a little wrestler come in by the name of Dundee sticking his nose into our business. He kept jumping into the ring because we hurt him. We hurt him. We made a mistake. He came back, Lance. He came back. That's right. He'll be back wait, Tuesday wait, wait, wait. night. This was his mistake. You know, when he come back, this is his mistake because now we're going to have to cripple him again. You know, people say we brag and boast. And, uh, you know, well, maybe we do. But we're the champions, so... You're the champions, there's no doubt about that, but Dundee's but got said, a long memory. He has got a partner because we hurt the, his other partner. But we will destroy. We Tuesday will night, we you'll will see him. Beat these men. Big uh, return match coming up in just a moment with Lucas and Morton against Vanya and Tojo with standing here. No identification necessary. The king out here, Jerry, thank you for coming out here. We, we told him at the uh, very opening of the program 
big news today. You're going to be telling us about the official plans for your doctor release and when you can officially get back into action in there. And I already mentioned the unusual bout that will be your opener in there. Well, this, this is the day, Lance, that I've been waiting for for almost 11 months now. Uh, it was February the 3rd when I broke my leg, and uh, I came out here several times and then back trips back and forth to the doctor, and, I, and I'm sure my doctors would...